What's going on guys? It's Tyler Frazier over here at Orlando Harley Davidson today on this beautiful Wednesday. In front of us, we have the Bright Billiard Blue Road King Special. This is a new colorway they got for 2023. This is an amazing bike. I love it. It's probably one of my favorites in the touring uh, category. I used to have a Road Glide Special that will always have a you know near and dear place in my heart, but I always tell my wife the next bike is going to be a Road King. Kind of want to build something out, a little more classic, slim down look. Uh, this beautiful bike right in front of us is in the blackout trim package. We are unsure if there's going to be a chrome package that's going to be available in the specials or if Harley will be coming back out with a standard in chrome. They may have something in store with it being an anniversary year, uh, possibly maybe a mid-year release anniversary color and or maybe a CVO, who knows? We'll see. There hasn't been any rumors or talk yet, but that's something I think we all love to see come from the Harley Davidson factory. Now, as always guys, this has your six gallon tank. So you're gonna get plenty of fuel to go down the highway, plenty of comfort as well. You have features such as cruise control that come on this bike, as well as the RDRS system is an option on this bike as well, which is kind of handy. I've used it, uh, I had it on my previous bike and I've used it quite a few times uh, going over some bridges and whatnot like that, the hill assist, as well as in some slippier conditions, uh, and some off camber turns, feeling the rear end kind of slip out. It really does help out. Um, the nice, amazing thing about this bike, right, is that it gives you that class, classic clean silhouette where there's not too much going on, but you do still have the touring frame and touring chassis and capabilities of the touring bike where you can throw a windshield on here and have that bigger gas tank and not have any issues with your bags in the rear as well to carry all your gear. Something special we do here at Orlando Harley is we always put the docking hardware on all of our new bikes. So you can come in here, throw a sissy bar from our parts department on the back of there and or a tour pack, add more storage or a comfy seat for your significant other in the rear there. That way you guys can cruise down the highway with ease. A nice thing about the specials is that they come with the mustache bar um, in the front there, which is kind of nice because it's slimmer than the previous generation bar where it sat up taller, like you see on the standards. For someone taller like myself, it's very easy to throw your foot up on there and kind of use it as a footrest or a highway peg, which kind of knocks out two birds with one stone on this particular model. Now, something I like to do with all of my other videos is for height and size reference and things of that nature is throw a leg over each bike and guys, give you guys a visual. So I'm 6'2", 215, and I'll throw my leg over her real quick for you. So, like I was saying, this bike kind of just fits like a glove, right? It's a touring bike, feels great. You got the big tank right in front of you, but it doesn't feel too big because when you put your legs up on here, it doesn't feel like you're bulging out to the side or anything like that. You got a nice tight grip on there. And as you can see, the foot pedal is right there where I need it. Plenty of room to move around on the floorboard. And then the same thing with that highway bar right there, right? So it is an engine guard bar. It's not necessarily meant to be a highway peg, but taller guys like myself, we can rest our feet up there and it kind of doubles as the same thing. Now, another unique thing, right, is this bike actually compared to the uh, road glides and the street glides is you actually have mini apes on here. So it kind of already puts your hands up in a more comfortable position. I like the more T-bar style, right? So this has kind of a T-bar bend, but it's a little wider. It's not necessarily a T-bar, they're mini apes, but similar feel. Um, so right as you can see, there's no fairing or navigation or anything like that right here in front of me blocking my view. So you kind of get to see the road and what's in front of you, which gives you a completely different feel than riding with a bike with a fairing, right? So definitely something exciting and new um, is if you haven't ridden a bike like this or if you're coming off other brands um, or models such as, you know, V-Stars and Shadows and things like that, and you're kind of not sure what kind of bike to get onto with a Harley, but you want that cruiser feel, this is definitely a good model for that, where it has a similar layout, but doesn't have anything too crazy going on in the front to make you too nervous or anything like that, because you can always add those things on in the future. So that pretty much concludes the video for this Bright Billiard Blue 2023 Road King Special. If you guys have any comments or questions or concerns, uh, leave a comment below on this video and we'll get back to you and or call into the dealership and ask for myself. Um, Lauren will be the receptionist answering and she could transfer it over to me and I'll be more than happy to help you out or email me at tfraser at orlandoharley.com and I'll answer your questions there. Uh, we'd love to get you out on a test ride. If you're unsure what model that you want to do, 
or get into next. That's a beautiful thing we do here is we have all of our used bikes and new bikes available for test rides as long as you got your endorsement. That way you can really see what fits you perfect and leave out of here hopefully on the bike of your dreams because that's what we're here to do every day. So enjoy this video guys. I hope uh, you come back for more. You like, comment and subscribe and uh, just keep supporting the channel. We'll see you soon.